it's Nerdy Dog Girl again here. Uh, before we do the box opening, uh, I have a couple of things to discuss and to show you. So first of all, I want to apologize because once again I've had to do my video when it's been really crummy outside and it's very dark. So I have this so lovely bright light that kind of washes me out and uh, yeah not the best video quality so I apologize for that but um, hopefully you guys still enjoy this video I'm really struggling because my hairdresser her best friend passed away probably a month or two months ago I'm gonna say two months ago and uh, she's the only hairdresser that I trust and so as you can see my hair is really crappy right now as well as that I haven't made it to the um, to get my eyebrows done so I'm just kind of insecure about the way I look right now but I have boxes to open so I just kind of hope you guys focus on the stuff and not so much me so there's a couple things that I accidentally opened not realizing what they were so I kind of didn't show you guys those envelope openings but I thought I would show you to them show you to them show you now so starlight designs I believe the lady's name is do I have my phone with me yes I do um I'm prepared this time so um there's a lady on Etsy and as well on Instagram and I actually got this off of Instagram let me just double check that I have the right name Starshine Designs she uh, she makes all sorts of stuff and she was offering some MSD bags so bags to carry your MSDs around and I've never bought a bag for my MSD before because I just kind of carry them around myself and I've never really found a bag design that I really feel um, kind of lives up to what I want. I really love the Akagi doll bags. They're amazing. But sometimes you don't want to carry such a big puffy bag and also... Sometimes I find it's a little nerve-wracking because of how padded they are that I worry they're going to squash the face and the eyelashes. So anyways, uh, she had this sale on that she ha was putting up before she put on her Etsy uh, site. And I just had to buy it because of the pattern. I just love the pattern. I think it's going to work really, really well for a character that I'm thinking of. So I thought I'd show you guys. Isn't this amazing? It's like pumpkins and kitty cats and owls. And I know it's like a Halloween themed bag, but I don't care. I love it and I will carry it around no matter what the time of year. It's kind of like magical. And then the inside is lined with this gorgeous, I think it's like faux sheet or something I don't know I'm not good with uh, fabrics but super soft and and it's white so you don't have to worry about it staining and then here is her label sorry it is backwards but I will link her Instagram and Etsy down below but yeah it's just a really cute little bag and I cannot wait to try it and then so I already have one of these wigs but I had to buy another one because they're super amazing quality and um, when I looked on the website 90% of their items were sold out and I don't know if they're gonna bring them back anytime soon or at all so I just went ahead and bought what I wanted uh, there was a couple colors that I really, really wanted that they, they didn't have, but that's okay. At least I got these. So, they're little wigs. 
with little wo little ears like wolves or foxes and then a little tail. So I got an MSC size and I got an SD size. And I'm so excited and I cannot wait to put them on. I'm probably going to put them on my little rebel Kalar when he comes. And then of course the MSC one will go on Ziggy for now at least. So here is the MSD tail. So it's really fluffy and it looks like you just pin it on to his outfit. And then, so cute, cute little ears. It's hard to see necessarily in this light, but these are cute little ears. So I will be putting them on my dollies and probably in the next video I will show you what it looks like, but I really want to get to my box openings. So come on, stuff yourself in there. All right. So I'm going to open the one that is exciting, but I'm more excited about the other one. So the first one is from Alice Collections. I probably shouldn't show you that side. Uh, from Alice Collections. Uh, I ordered this uh, maybe two months ago. And I got these to do some practice face-ups because of the price. So there you can see inside and of course the awesome magic eraser that comes with almost I pretty much think it comes with all the Alice collection uh, sales so they're smaller size than I normally get but the price was insane like insanely good so I think these were originally $50 and they're on sale right now for $18. And if you buy two of them, I think shipping is, airmail shipping is free. So I paid like 30 back, uh, sorry, $35. And yeah, I'm so, so excited. So two heads for 35 bucks plus free shipping, pretty awesome. I cannot say enough about Alice Collections and how amazing they are. Oh my god, it's so tiny! Hey. Super tiny. Oh, it's so precious. So this is a Doll Family A head. And I will link it down below for you guys. So I got two. Now I don't know what I was thinking because these are really tiny. But that's okay. Uh, it's still good practice. So there is the little tan head, which of course is not showing up as tan with this light. But this is the little tan head. And I'll wrap it back up better after. And then I got one other. If you guys know me, I love tan skin. Hence why I got my Kalar in the tan skin. Because I just love tan skin. So I got the tan skin and then I got one in normal skin. I really, really need a ring light. Oh man, light. there we go. A little bit. Sorry, it's not focusing very much. But there's the super tiny, super tiny little cuties. And then they have the head cap come off here. Super awesome. Now, next is the box that I am the most excited about. So I ordered from Taobao, but 
but I got a very, I ordered from Taobao, but it's a very, very little box. But that's okay, because it's got some really cool stuff in it. do the clothes and I'm super excited because they have started doing uh, this shipping that is like EMS shipping but is cheaper so the first thing is this adorable set of overalls Let's see how this works. So this adorable little set of overalls for SD. They're so cute. And they were a super awesome price. I will link that down below. So it looks like you can undo the, the back with a Velcro and then this cute little uh, the little straps can undo like a real pair of overalls. So I just need to find an SD girl that I love that will fit these. If you have not seen my last video, I got a Mayu Delia and a tan skin MSD body. And unfortunately the... Um, the Delia was just, I just, I don't like the body and the face is, the face is gorgeous, but it's just not, um, for me enough to, to sell the body and then try and find a head and I mean, sorry, sell the body and try and find a body that I like. So, um, yeah, so I'm selling her and the tan skin body is Oh, it's so beautiful. The skin color is just gorgeous, but unfortunately the body is not double jointed and it's, double jointed bodies are super important to me. Um, so I am selling that as, as well. So four months wait for having to sell it. It's very frustrating, but that's kind of the risk you take sometimes. I'm sorry for the noise. <laughs> My family is all home. So it's a little noisy. So I also got a pair of MSD size shorts, uh, overall shorts, and they're in a darker color than the SD, which I don't mind. They're so cute. But I'm hoping, just looking at them, I'm hoping that they fit, they fit, um, Ziggy because it's very wide at the bottom so I don't know if these are meant for like a child size MSD I'm really hoping not I'm really hoping not because I love them but uh, but yeah we'll see we'll see and then I got a pair of Rack pants for one of my boys in gray. I have, I do have track pants already, but they're kind of puffy. So I wanted kind of like, I don't remember what those kind of pants are called, but they're kind of, they're tight on the bottom and then puffy outwards. I'm sorry guys, this light is driving me nuts. There we go. Uh, so I thought I would get these ones, and again, super cheap. So, nice and long and stretchy. So I gotta put that on one of my boys. I like, I'm a clothes horse. I love, I think that's the right term. I love clothes. I don't find clothes in my size that I love very often without them costing an arm and a leg. So, um, I kind of go nuts on, on, uh, doll clothes. 
I have way too many clothes and not as many dolls. So, then I found these amazing t-shirts for SD boys, because they are the ones that are dry, like making me swoon right now. So the first one is Stop Sushi Time. And the quality I can tell right now is super amazingly good. I love that the iron-on is nice quality. It does not look cheap. And the colors are nice and bright. And then the next one, it's pretty cool. When I ordered these, you bought two and you got one free. So this is the one I got for free. It's a little tiger with a little uh, winter hat on. I love tigers. They're my favorite animals. They're just so beautiful. Well, I guess I can't say that I have so many favorite animals. I just love animals. But tigers kind of, big cats and stuff, they kind of re represent the way I feel a lot of the time. Plus I'm a Leo. Uh, so, and then the last one is so cool. If anyone, you know, plays Pokemon or, uh, Pokemon, Pokemon Go or watches the show, you will definitely understand why this is super cool. Oh, goodness. So, I think his name is Meowth. I'm not a huge super, um, super, I'm not a huge Pokemon fan, but this t-shirt was just too cute. I couldn't pass it up. And then I think, can't remember what the fish's name is, but, um, I've played book, the Pokemon Go, so I kind of know some of them. I just can't remember the fish's name. So that's so cool. And again, the quality of these t-shirts, I'm just super impressed by them. I love Taobao. It's very addicting. <laughs> and then the last thing, I really was quite surprised by the, the quality of this company for the price. Before we do look at that, I did order, I forgot, I ordered some random uh, gift dies. So you bought them for ten dollars and you got three random ones and so these are actually really pretty I like them the first one is like a take it out. sometimes I find the the lucky boxes or what have you I've been disappointed in the past by the clothing ones uh, now granted I have not bought like a ton of them so if you have and you've had a good experience let me know but a lot of times I find that it's like stuff that nobody else wants so I tend to not do that anymore but these eyes are actually really really nice and they're glass so it's like a greeny a greeny a greeny blue color and then Why do they have to make everything so hard to get into? <laughs> and no, like, I, th I don't know if this is the right term because it's not a BJD, but there's no fleshing on the eyes. Sometimes when you buy glass eyes that are made, uh, usually the homemade ones, there's some fleshing on it. But this one is pretty good. There's just a little bit of roughness there. So there's like a bluey one. And for $10, I'm not disappointed at all. I think these are really pretty and really good quality. And then there's like a, I don't know if that's purple or what color it is, but there's little flecks of something in it. I think it's purpley brown or something. So those are really cool and I like those. I like those. Sorry, I already said that, but I do. Uh, so anyways, I was watching, I think it was One Play. 
that did a video on this doll. I will link that all as well down below. But she got this doll for an insanely cheap price. Unfortunately, I think it must have been a sale because they weren't as cheap as she had uh, advertised kind of on her channel. But I was able, I didn't want to buy the whole doll because of the price. But I was able to get a head with face up. So I'm hoping that she is as pretty and as nice as she was advertised. Very cool. Oh no, her eyelashes got squashed. So this is from, she is from, please let me know if I uh, pronounce it wrong, Feck Doll, which I believe is a Chinese company. And I believe they have a website, but, uh, but uh, I got it off Taobao. And they're licensed uh, sellers because I asked. Um, I mean, I looked up feckdoll.com or whatever the address is. Yeah, feck slash doll.com. And this was listed as uh, official dealer. So this is the girl I got the head of. She's really pretty. So let me see if I can kind of... Get her eye to work a little bit, her eyelash to move a little bit. So I think the face up was like five or ten bucks. Don't quote me, but it was super cheap. So here she is. Isn't she beautiful? And the whole the whole head cost me fifty. 50 or 55 bucks with the face up and everything. So I think that's a pretty good price. I know some uh, heads you can get for, um, I think the cheapest head that's from a company that does, well, I know you can get some on resin sole and stuff, but anyways, so I wanted just a different, a different girl. So yeah, she's beautiful. I'm hoping that her skin tone is similar to Resin Soul because I would really like to be able to put her head on a Resin Soul body. Let's see. These eyes are a little big. Yeah, they're creepy. <laughs> Yeah, that's creepy. So yeah, um, I'm going to try her on the resin sole body that I got, that I'm getting for Christmas. And uh, if it works, then I'll be super excited. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this box opening video. Again, I apologize for the lighting. Um, I think from this point forward, I will just have to suck it up and uh, wait till it's a brighter day to open the, uh, blah, 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 to do box openings or figure something to do about these this lighting problem so thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button I try and do a video every weekend sometimes I might do a couple videos during the week, but um, yeah, I try and do at least one video on the weekends. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye.